Have you ever wondered how roosters fertilize chicken eggs? Today, we're gonna to unravel the mysteries of the chicken coop. Contrary to common belief, hens don't require the presence of a rooster to lay eggs. However, if you're hoping for those eggs to crack open, revealing, fluffy chicks, then a rooster's role becomes crucial. Roosters are not just chick makers, though. They serve as the protectors of the flock, keeping an ever watchful eye for potential threats. So how do roosters fertilize eggs? Let's dive into the fascinating process. The mating process of chickens might surprise you. It's quite different from mammals, and it all comes down to a brief but crucial moment of contact between the rooster and the hen. This moment is known as cloacal contact. The cloaca is a multi-purpose opening in birds used for excretion and reproduction. The rooster and hen touch their cloacas together for just a second and in that tiny window of time sperm is transferred from the rooster to the hen. This may seem like a fleeting moment but it's all that's needed for the hen to fertilize multiple eggs. This is because hens have a remarkable ability to store the rooster's sperm in their bodies, using it over a period of time to fertilize the eggs they lay. This efficient process enables the hen to continue laying fertilized eggs for up to two weeks after just one mating. So the next time you see a rooster and a hen together, remember that their mating process is a marvel of efficiency and precision. It's a fascinating glimpse into the intricate world of avian reproduction, where a brief moment of contact can lead to the creation of new life. Now that we understand the mating process, how can we tell if an egg has been fertilized? Identifying a fertilized egg can be quite a task. However, there are a couple of tricks that can help you in this detective work. One method involves spotting a distinct pattern on the egg yolk, often referred to as the bullseye. This is a small circular mark that indicates that the egg has been fertilized. Another technique you can use is called candling. This involves holding the egg up to a light source in a dark room which allows you to see inside the egg. If you can see a network of blood vessels or a dark spot that moves, it's likely that the egg is fertilized. However, it's important to remember that these methods are not foolproof. Sometimes the signs of fertilization can be hard to spot or may not be visible at all. But these techniques can give you a good indication of whether a rooster's magic has worked its way into the egg so we've learned how roosters fertilize eggs and how to identify a fertilized egg. But what if your rooster's too aggressive? Um, aggressive roosters can be a challenge, but there are ways to manage them. Roosters by nature are protectors. They maintain order within the flock and keep a watchful eye for predators. But when a rooster becomes overly aggressive, it can disrupt the harmony of the flock, causing stress and even injury to the hens. Removing such a rooster from the flock is a crucial step. It's not a decision to be taken lightly because remember, roosters play a vital role in the life cycle of chickens, particularly in fertilizing eggs. However, the safety and well being of the hens should always come first. Consider rehoming the aggressive rooster or isolating him from the flock until his behavior improves. There are also various techniques available to help mitigate aggressive behaviors, such as behavior modification or even consulting with a poultry specialist. Remember, as a chicken owner, the peace and productivity of your flock depend on the decisions you make. In the end, each chicken owner must make decisions that suit their individual circumstances. Let's, let's recap what we've learned today. We started off by understanding the fascinating world of roosters and chickens. 
we then delved into the nitty gritty of the mating process, discovering how roosters fertilize eggs through cloacal contact. We learned that while hens can lay eggs without a rooster, having one around is essential if you're looking to hatch chicks. We also discussed how you can identify a fertilized egg. Remember to look for the bullseye on the yolk or try candling, a method that uses light to highlight the contents of an egg. Lastly, we touched upon the crucial aspect of managing aggressive roosters. Their protective role in the flock can sometimes turn into aggression, and it's important for us to recognize this and take appropriate action. So there you have it, a quick rundown of the fascinating world of roosters and hens. Understanding these aspects is key to successful chicken rearing. Remember, understanding the role of roosters and in their interaction with hens is vital for any chicken owner. Happy chick rearing.